My experience with stewardship, more or less, began in the Roman Catholic Church when I served as an altar boy and a member of the student choir at the Catholic boarding school where I lived from ages 5 to 12. I say more or less because I see it now as a starting point for any child to look beyond themselves and contribute something to others, even if it was limited to the sanctuary filled with nuns and fellow boarding school residents. Alas, my experience with Christian stewardship was not truly realized until decades later, when, as an adult, I joined the United Church of Christ. For the first time, I took on a role of church leadership when I became a member of the Board of Deacons for the First Congregational Church in Vernon, Connecticut. I also volunteered as a youth leader for the church when I agreed to be a scoutmaster for the church's resident scout troop. When entering Vanderbilt Divinity School as a graduate student in the Master of Divinity program, I joined Brookmead Congregational Church in Nashville, Tennessee where I again joined the church choir, but this time I became a volunteer for the church's homeless mission. Our stewardship to that mission involved the serving of meals to the community's homeless and provided them within the church facility a place to sleep. This service was especially helpful on cold winter nights where the homeless were unable to stay at other community shelters. I would volunteer for overnight sleep duty. Upon returning to Maine, I joined the First Congregational Church in Waterville, Maine, became a member of the Board of Deacons, joined the church choir, and lent my videographer skills to document the church's mission to assist a Christian community in a small Honduran village who were building their new church sanctuary. Having moved to the Lewiston-Auburn area after marrying Deborah, I joined High Street Congregational Church. It is here, I believe, that my stewardship experience has peaked. I have chaired the Board of Deacons, become a regularly assigned liturgist, and once more joined the church choir. I have preached from the pulpit a time or two, and have become something of a video archivist of sermons and special events within the church. Lately, as I am somewhat limited in my physical capacities uh, due to cancer, I continue to produce video hymns for our Zoom services during this ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Yet, having witnessed the stewardship this church extends to the Auburn community, what with the food pantry, our outreach to nearby residents, and how we extend our church facilities to various community organizations, I have come to know a deeper understanding of what stewardship truly means to all of us. Stewardship makes us not only instruments of God's will on earth, but also as witnesses to God's grace in the world. By giving of our gifts and talents to our brothers and sisters in the communities where we live, we become what the Apostle Paul would describe as the functioning appendages of the body of Christ. Our hands and feet, arms and legs, heads and hearts, when guided by the Holy Spirit, enable us to do God's work. If we just stop to contemplate and observe what we do for those in need, we are blessed with the knowledge that our efforts touch the lives of those who pray for a better day.